Hey everyone, this is David. I've been on a buying um, spree on eBay, and now I have uh, four step ups or boosters and step downs, and I'll show you a little bit about each one. Let's start with the biggest one we have here. So this one is a step down. You can take any voltage from 28 to 60 volts. And the reason why I bought it is because I do have a 36 volt battery. I do have a 48 volt battery. So when I'm running my e-bike, I can um, use this. I can uh, split the power and have a 12 volt application going at the same time. So that could be a light, a 12 volt light. It could be hand warmers that run on 12 volts. It could be, um, I can make, uh, I don't know, hot water. I can go camping with this thing. Maybe an electric blanket, perhaps. I, I really don't know yet, but um, it seemed like it was kind of fun, and now um, I can use all these 12 volt appliances. That's why I got it. This thing is water. One thing I, why I bought this was that it seemed like it was waterproof, um, and it had this big heat sink, and I thought that might be good, that it'll last a long time. And there's no way to get access to the inside of this. And I think um, I'm using some wires that I cobbled together. Um, Mike from EV Philly um, made this wire with an Anderson plug. And I've bought uh, these connectors from LunaCycle. These are XT90Ss. So I'm using this for 12 volt applications that can connect um, directly to my main power source. All right, let's move on. So I have this thing. So once once, I, once I'm running on 12 volts, I can connect this with a Anderson power pole, and then I can charge up my phone or any type of other 5-volt application. So what I do is once I get these, um, I write down the voltage on the back with a magic marker because it, sometimes it doesn't say what it is. I mean, I, I know from the eBay auction or whatever, but then I write down it, it can accept up to a 7 to 24 volts. And then probably it's going to be about a 1 volt, um, 1 amp, uh, or a 5 amp um, output. So I tried it. So now with this and this, I can um, charge up a cell phone while I ride. Before, I didn't have that op option unless I, you know, got a, a separate battery bank or something. I think um, if you're a new bike builder or if you're building bikes, customers want something that they can plug in their 12 volt applications and they want to be able to charge up their uh, their devices from a battery. So this is a, and for the price, it was what, two bucks? Four, four, I think this one was four bucks. It was a good deal, I think. So this is something I just got today. And you can see that I already put my uh, magic marker stuff on it. Uh, input is 3 to 12 volts, and the output is going to be 12 volts. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to uh, put a lot of these little batteries all together to make a 12-volt system. And then you can see how small it is compared to this, or you can see how small it is. I was thinking about making um, gloves that heated gloves and using this to regulate the voltage. You can see how small it is, so I'm going to put this in one of the gloves that I make. Um, something like uh, something like this glove, and then this is going to be sewn in somewhere, and then with some batteries so that um, my, uh, my hands will be nice and warm this winter. Okay, let's move on. So I've seen this um, was pretty popular and being sold. I don't have to write anything on the back of it because the uh, the voltage in and the voltage out are right there. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to be using this for, but I do like the metal case. It um, looks like it was it's very well made. I see um, some of the uh, popular uh, bike shops such as EM3EV, they carry this or carry different ones. What I see with this is that I can probably um, 
uh, string a whole bunch of these uh, batteries that I have together. And then I can um, make it into a 12 volt system or I can, um, since it's variable, I guess you can change it from here. There's a little pin. And right now I have a, um, a multimeter just to find out the voltages. Uh, I've been playing around using just the uh, AA batteries to see what it's all about. So these are uh, some of them. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like I said, uh, once you can change your voltage, you can use it to run different applications. Uh, I'll let you know how this goes in further uh, videos, but I hope you liked uh, this video. Take care. Bye.